Hi everyone. As you can see, I'm at St Bennett's today. I'm here to see Sarah and Ben, who've had this lovely cruiser. The swans have arrived. As have two magnificent wooden sailing yachts. Just had a scone and a glass of something rather nice and now we're setting off. I didn't know we were going for a trip along the river so come along and let's go and see what we see today. Now going along I'm trying to film this way for shorts in the portrait format and then I'm using my camera to try and film at the same time for an ordinary YouTube video. But of course it doesn't work, does it? So, as you can see, you've got a mixture of both formats. So just bear with me. It's always a learning curve, isn't it? So here we are, just passing St Bennett's Abbey. Now you know just a few seconds ago, I said we had scones and a glass of something nice. Well now Ben's making me a cup of tea and we've got the cheese straws out. <laughs> it's great, it really is. <laughs> Just watch this tree passing us. Looks like the tree's moving and not the boat, doesn't it? As you've probably seen online, there's been a spring tide causing a salt surge quite high up the rivers. And this appears to be one of the casualties from that event. I'm going to assume this is a pumping station. Whether it still works or not, I don't know. But look how pretty it is. Across the river, where you can see the masts, is the dike that goes up to Bureside campsite. And up on the hill, is Thurn Church, which has a hole in the wall. I presume most of you have been and visited it. And in the times where there were monks at St Benet's Abbey, if help was needed in the village, they would light a candle and place it in the hole of the church. The monks would see this candle burning, get in a rowing boat and go and see what the problem was in the village. This is the entrance to Upton Dyke. And on the opposite side are the moorings at Toby. Next is Clipsby Mill. Sarah's watched my channel for a long time and she can remember in the early days when my videos were really short and I didn't have any sound in them. I didn't speak in them, no music. And she quite liked that. But here I am chatting all the way through this. <laughs> Sorry, Sarah.
When it gets too windy, I've had to take all the sand out completely. Next, we have the Northern River Sailing Club. And a short distance from there is a sweet little holiday property. I think the sign on the little holiday property says Old Mill Fishley. Fishley is the parish that has a church, but no parishioners, no properties, just a big manor house or hall. I'd just like to thank you both for a wonderful afternoon. Enjoy the rest of your week. And I hope it's not too cold and rainy for you. This next bird looks like a brown heron. Is that a bittern, do you think? I think so. Well, here we are. We're now moored to Akel and I'm getting off the boat. My chariot has arrived to take me back to St Bennett's to get my car. Thank you all for watching.